So last week I posted this Python versus SQL for data analysis blog post on the Airbyte website. And I got some great comments that I wanted to share with you. I particularly liked this one comment on LinkedIn with the user who said, wow, it's like you're saying apple or sausage, which I thought was a great and actually really insightful comment because if someone would ask me that question, I would say both, please. That sounds like a great combo. That was also kind of the point of the article that I wrote, so I'm not entirely sure this person read the blog, but I try to show that Python and SQL are tools that are built for different parts of the data processing pipeline. And so you will most likely want to use both. What I think is actually most exciting is that there's a trend towards new tools that are bridging the gap between the two languages. So there's dbt that allows you to do version control that you you'd normally have in Python and do that with your SQL models. And then there are tools like Dask Snowflake that allow you to write very efficient SQL queries within your Python scripts that can run in parallel with distributed fetch. So I think really the sort of overlap between the two languages is the most exciting space at the moment. If you haven't read the blog yet, go check it out at the link below and let me know what you think. Cheers.